Orchard students look forward to a new building. I heard that it was going to be pretty big and better than our old, old school. But for the science projects you see here, Orchard's middle schoolers gave serious thought to how it can be better. The students have been studying what's called problem-based learning all year. All kinds of health and wellness issues are addressed in this science fair, and the projects were created with a brand new Orchard school in mind. We brainstormed a list of ideas and they had to commit to one of those ideas to solve a problem um, either using the existing interior or the existing exterior space of the floor plan that the new building will be built on. Half of this is the kitchen and half is the cafeteria. A fairly standard school dining facility, but Talia's design promotes healthy choices. Right here we're trying to make it so people stay healthy. This is a buffet that has healthy foods in it, fresh meat, fresh vegetables and fruits. Everything's healthy so you can't get too much. The vending machine has healthy stuff like granola bars and yogurt. The students were encouraged to choose health issues that hit close to their own homes. And then it's personal, it connects to them, so they have like a vested interest in seeing the solution actually come to fruition. My parents, you know, they've been through a lot of stress. That's the inspiration for Deanna's stress room. I made some hammocks, there's some pools, there's um, some laptops, and there's a, like a hot tub in there. It's quiet, you don't have to deal with no kids, no hassle, nothing. Like, you don't have to deal with no problems, because it's quiet and it's peaceful. Like, look at it, it's quiet. <laughs> Ain't nothing going on in there. <laughs> I know a couple people that has family members that have breast cancer. So the pink floors featured in Damon's project are in honor of breast cancer patients. For our art room, we pretty much make um, the stuff that we're gonna donate to them and um, make cards to show that we care. And for our meeting room, we have our computers and to tell us how many people are in hospitals and which hospitals has the people with breast cancer. Even if their ideas don't end up in the final design of the new orchard, the students here figure what they end up with will still be better than what they've had. Yeah, the school's small. We can't do nothing there. Reporting for CMSD, I'm Brian McIntyre.